This video is presented by VoiceOver Article. I got a call from a woman who said I need credit card loss protection insurance. I thought there was a law that limited my liability to $50 for your authorized charges. But she said the law had changed and that now, people are liable for all your authorized charges on their account. Is that true? Don't buy the pitch and don't buy the loss protection insurance. Telephone scam artists are lying to get people to buy worthless credit card loss protection and insurance programs. If you didn't authorize a charge, don't pay it. Follow your credit card issuer's procedures for disputing charges you haven't authorized. According to the Federal Trade Commission, your liability for your authorized charges is limited to $50. The FTC says worthless credit card loss protection offers are popular among fraudulent promoters who are trying to exploit consumers' uncertainty. As a result, the agency is cautioning consumers to avoid doing business with callers who claim that you're liable for more than $50 in your authorized charges on your credit card account. You need credit card loss protection because computer hackers can access your credit card number and charge thousands of dollars to your account. A computer bug could make it easy for thieves to place your authorized charges on your credit card account, and they're from the security department and want to activate the protection feature on your credit card. The FTC advises consumers not to give out personal information including their credit card or bank account numbers over the phone or online unless they are familiar with the business that's asking for it. Scam artists can use your personal information to commit fraud, such as identity theft. That's where someone uses some piece of your personal information such as your credit card account number, social security number, mother's maiden name, or birth date, without your knowledge or permission to commit fraud or theft. An all too common example is when an identity thief uses your personal information to open a credit card account in your name. Be smart and learn what you are personally responsible for. Protect your credit cards and your identity. This video is presented by Voice Over Article.